entire Israeli-Palestinian conflict was based on racism. It was racist Jews who felt before the creation of Israel and today, till today, that Jews and Palestinians cannot live together side by side as equal in a secular democracy. So 750,000 Palestinians were forcefully removed out of Palestine, removed from their homes, their villages, and the Jews took over and then occupied several million Palestinians. Now, Israel camouflaged this with security and um, a Jewish state, etc., etc. But in essence, this whole thing at its core is racism because the Jews can have security, much more security, in fact, than what they have now. They don't have to be dominant. They don't have to be exclusive in order to have security. And that's really where the problem arise, that the Jews claim that they need to be exclusive, they need to have a Jewish state, and that they will have to be always, always dominant. And that really means that the conflict will remain forever because you cannot really claim exclusivity and have the minority, even really equal number of people to you accepting that. They're not gonna accept that. And it's not good for you to be exclusive. A Jewish state is really a danger to the Jewish people because it can never be a true democratic state. So all the wars that Israel and the Palestinians and the surrounding Arab nations have been involved in in the last 73, 74 years, and there were many, many, many thousands of people have been killed and families have suffered, is because of the racism and because of a major error in understanding that the only way to live in peace and the only way to live for a long term is to have equality and to have secular democracy. And Israel refuses to have secular democracy that accepts everyone. So this is why I suggest that the Israeli government is not ever going to accept equality for Palestinians. They're just not going to do that because it's contrary to the idea of a Jewish state. So I suggest creating a common government with the Israelis and the Palestinian people together, a government that will be created outside the Israeli government or the Palestinian government, a government that will treat everyone as equal, a secular democracy that will work for everyone, one person, one vote, that would be equal to everyone and give peace to the Palestinian and the Israeli people together.